Okay. We got our box back from PSA. The, I, I have scratched out the name. But we got our box back. And we believe that this box contains the Joe Montana 1981 rookie card number 216. From Tops. From Tops. So PSA sent me a note and I did not click through to see what the grade was. I assume the grade is not a 9 or a 10 because I think they would have asked for more insurance on the way back, which probably means it's not an 8 either. Uh, so th those hopes are gone. I don't, th I don't think it's a 9 or 10. You never know. Maybe maybe yeah. they forgot to send the insurance form, but I don't think it's a 9 or 10. We, we Here's a picture of, of what yeah. we sent in. So this is a card that we've had for 40 yeah. years. As you can see, it's like a little bit off center, left to right. I don't know if you guys can tell. It's hard to tell when it's not actually there. It's a little bit sent. It's it's a little bit to the left the and a little bit to the bottom. Corners look kind of good though. Corners are good. It's been in a binder for forty years, thirty eight years. Yeah. All right. So yeah, well, I predict a five. Yeah, just, I predict uh, seven or eight. I, I thought it was pretty good, but we're going to be satisfied with this six or above. We're yeah. going to be satisfied. You guys, you guys can comment below what you, what you think it is, just from that picture. But. Yeah, you want to put that picture up one more time? Sure. Just so you know, a ten goes for about seventy thousand dollars. If we get a ten and we decide to sell, we're going to have to. Yeah, we're probably going to sell it. But a five probably. goes for about three to four hundred dollars. Yeah. So that's that's the range. All right, so this is classic PSA boxing back. It's really, really hard to get into. Oh, yeah. Do you want to see in the cover of the grade so we can like reveal it? Yeah. I don't know how, if we'll be able to do it. I'm also, like, they don't say it's from Collector's Universe anymore. They just say it's from CU. I don't know if people were swiping uh, Collector's Universe boxes. I guess we can just use this box. That's fine. That's fine. Or one of those. So let's figure out how to open this. I mean, they don't make it easy. Well, I don't want to get rid of No, no, that's one good thing about the old uh, Collector's Universe people. Also, I sent this card in by itself, just one card only. And this is before PSA raised prices. And then it's also before PSA shut down. So we just sent this thing in regular in early February. Is that one ago? Yeah, if you look at that, you can see the date of that picture. Yeah. I think it was sent in like February 3rd. Oh, wow. And today is what, April? April something. Oh, I thought you were talking about February 3rd of last year. No, 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 February 3rd of this year. Yeah. So it actually came back yeah, pretty came quickly. Yeah, came back pretty fast then, considering what it's taking now. Now we had a learning experience with PSA because we sent in something express when it was two went back when it was two hundred dollars. Yeah, it was a Michael Jordan card. And it came back with pretty low grade, unfortunately. So I, that's when I said we're not doing any of this ex express or super express anymore. Only if we pull like a crazy Lamello or something. Yeah. Zion. Okay. Building up the suspense here. Yeah. All right, there's the packaging. But PSA really does bubble it up nicely. And there's the card. Like I said, we sent in one do you card. Want, do you want to like? Do you want me to take it out and cover it, or what? I was thinking that we take it out while covered. So yeah. let's just again. Five or above, we're satisfied. Yeah. Six or above, we're, th we're pleased. Yeah. Seven or above. I don't know. I, I think it could be a seven or eight. Seven yeah. or above, we're happy. Yeah. And we, we don't know. Wow. Well, it looks like the, the this is the bottom of the card. Oh, it is? Because you can see it says QB right okay. there. See that? Oh, yeah. It says QB. So that's the bottom of the so card. This is the, the front. That's yeah. the front and that's the so bottom. We... So if you want to... Yeah. I was going to pull it out with the bubble wrap, maybe? 
You might have to keep this bubble like that. I don't know. I'll turn it upside down. Okay. So that should be upside down. There's some papers in there. I don't want to look at those. Yeah. Okay. So. How are we going to do this? Just make, make sure it's the back first, maybe. Yeah, this is the back. That's the back? Yeah. Alright, so let's take off the uh, bottom bubble wrap, maybe? Yeah. Okay, so there's the card, upside down. Yep. So this, we won't know from you looking at the back. You should be able to just open it, I think. No, what I'm saying is... The... Yeah, you should be able to just take that off. Yeah. Okay, there we go. So we don't know the grade. All we know is that it, it, it does look to be the correct card. You can't see the front, right? No. Okay. Should I just mean to cover it or do you just want to flip it? No, no, we're going to cover it. So it, it's in pretty good shape still. I mean, I guess the coloring is a, a touch off. Corners do look good. Yeah, centering, centering on the back is also way centered to the left. Oh, yeah. So we know, we, which is like essentially is the top yeah. on the front. So right. we know we're not expecting a 10. We're not expecting a 9. All right, so let's, uh, I got an idea. You got something? Yeah, I have, I have a thought. Let's, uh... Okay. And then flip it over. And then you can, then you can uh, figure out how you want to show it. Okay. So... All right. Well, last chance. Anyone who has a thought, let us know. I don't know if we, we can can't see, see that, yeah. we can't see that yet. Let's scooch that back a bit. I it, but you revealed it. Seven. It's a seven. It's a seven. Nineteen eighty one Top Show Montana two sixteen NM seven. That's not bad. We'll take it. You're expecting a, a four. I'm very. Five? I'm pleased with that. That's a nice card. It's a nice holder. It's, it's nice to actually get something back from PSA, of course. And it's a seven. Right. I'm guessing it's on set. You know, unfortunately, they don't give you any information. That's, and I think that's why these um, HGAs and Beckett's and other places are going to have a shot to, to take some market share from PSA because we got no, we got no feedback. Nothing on cornering, nothing on centering, nothing on shading, nothing on coloring, nothing on anything. Just just, just seven. a seven. Yeah. So a seven? We'll take it. We'll take. All right, that's it. If you want to uh, um, yeah. follow us on, on, on Twitter, it's uh, at Texas125Cards. Yeah, we haven't posted anything yet, but we plan we have plans for that. Okay. Yeah. Well, we're following a bunch of the card guys. Yeah. And so it's a fun, fun, uh, fun place to look. And then also like, make sure to like and subscribe to the video. That's right. That's right. Any likes and any subscriptions would be great. Yeah, and then leave a comment if you want. Yeah. All right. Well, there's Joe. Good job, Joe.